What's up there, fellow YouTubers? This is Chris from the Mars Anomalies channel. Um, all right, this is another one from the Saw 494. Um, this one here, just kind of going over these pictures, and of course, this is the latest picture. Uh, it's still like four years old. Um, four years old, be all right. Four days old. Um, I believe it was on the 26th this was taken, so just the day after Christmas, and of course, we're on the 31st today, which is, incidentally, is the last uh, video this year. Um, so, uh, but anyway... I'll jump right into it. You guys can tell me what you think this is. It appears to be a piece of steel to me, um, but that's not the only part to it. Um, well, let me just do it right here. Okay. This is the actual piece right here. Right in there. Um, zoom in, it appears to be some kind of like, uh, it's got like an edge right here. I'm going to try to zoom in a little bit here, but a little bit better. Um, it's right, you can see the edge of it going up right here. And you can get right here, but this also looks like there's some kind of lettering on this thing. If you look right here and up here, and this has been manipulated. I mean, look, you can see it like a bunch of things. Look at this right here. You can see that's been manipulated. It's something sticking out of the ground. And they just fudged that out. I mean, you can just see it. That's just as plain as day. Um, yeah, it doesn't get much easier than that. Um, there's a bunch of stuff. I mean, look at all these weird, like lighter, shinier rock or whatever this may be. That's kind of sticking out of the ground. Something else has been manipulated here. There's a lot of things here, but that's the only thing that really caught my eye and I really wanted to show you guys because even when I enhance this thing a little bit, you'll see it a little bit differently, but it's still, and that to me looks like a piece of steel, which implies what? Well, if this is truly Mars, of course, and I'm going to say 99% that I'm sure we are, but if the 1% is that we're not, well, then we know how that goes, but um, if it is if it is true, well, what does that imply? Well, it implies that they can actually... Um, they were definitely modern people, because if they're able to do that, then they're able to, able to build structures, cars, uh, whatever else is made of steel that, like we have, uh, uh, you know, we do here on Earth. So, uh, so that this picture has some importance to it, if you really think about it. So, um, let me jump out of this. Um, and here's the other one here. Like I said, I can zoom in right here. Okay, I think my mouse is gonna go stupid here on me. Um, now this is a little bit grainier because I'm really gonna zoom in, but. Um, so on my finger head is I thought it was a splinter or something. But anyway, so you get this ridge right you can just see the right there the edge of it, almost like uh, like you'd see in like an I beam kind of thing. You get that kind of edge going to it uh, top and bottom right here, right here. But see the way this looks like a like an upside down A kind of thing. Like it comes down one side, has this like top and it has like a little tail sticking out of it, and then has the other leg going down, but from that leg it goes like this, like it kinda of circles around to the other leg. See it kinda of, and then there's some kind of cube or something right here. It looks like right here, but of course you can't see it. And, you know, uh, that's understandable because it's either this is encrusted rock, but I also believe it's been modified. I don't know if this is two pieces because it appears there's like light in between this piece as well as this piece. There's no way of knowing whether what this is, but you see this a little bit differently, especially over here. There's a little bit kind of funky things here. It just, you can, and you can see the blurriness. So they definitely did something here. So, um, all right, let me zoom back out of that. Zoom, get into here. All right. Let me see what we got here. Um, jump right in. All right. Now, this is what I did. I just basically did this rock here, and that's basically what I want to tell you guys. And you guys can tell me what your, what your take is on it, too, because, I mean, I seen this thing, and I was just like, whoa. Um, because, like I said, that means a lot. If this is truly a piece of steel, and I believe it is because just the way it looks, um, then there's definitely something there as far as, like, uh, these people were able to build things, um, at least out of steel. I mean, it looks like a piece of aluminum, but, you know, who the heck knows? I can't be for sure, of course. Um, let me just blur it here, clean it up a little bit, um, and then just do a little shopping. Okay. And if you look right here, too, there's actually this little edge comes over here, and it looks like it comes down, it comes over to here, and down. Then it's got this cube-looking thing on the top. Now, again, I don't know if this has been, you know, uh, manipulated as well. In other words, this could have been something, just a little rod sticking out, and it just made a cube out of it. But either way, that just tells me it's just, it's like, I mean, it's just begging to be looked at. Because that's not something you see in nature, or at least not on top of something that looks like it's got a piece of steel in it. Um, and this right here has a different weird edge to it, too, when you uh, actually invert this. Um, and you'll see this right now. Watch this. Okay. See how much cleaner this looks like? It's got this nice uh, half-round piece right here. And it's got that uh, this weird block kind of thing sticking out. And it's also got this right here. That pot I was telling you about. It looks like there's something in that pot, too. In other words, it looks like a pocket kind of thing. And there's something in it. Um, okay, so we go to here. And you can see, like I said, it comes down. It's got this little weird thing. And 
I think you can see it better in the better uh, the normal picture. See right here. And I've actually flipped this thing upside down to, to check this out. Um, okay, I desaturated just to get rid of the color. And I mean, I'll keep it there. And you guys can. And in fact, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to go back here. Um, and if you guys want to take a better look at this thing with uh, with a magnifier or what have you, um, I'm just going to go ahead and do this. Um, I can probably go to 50, but that may be too small. But let's try the 50 for the heck of it for now. And I'll do that. Now, and you guys can look this over. This is before I blur or do anything like that. So um, I'll do the 50 and then the 100 like this here. Blur it up. Well, actually, I'll keep it like this. You guys can stop it any way you want. You know that. Um, you know, shopping. But to me, it, it actually has shapes to them. I mean, it looks like two separate pieces because at first... I was looking at this and it looked like one big solid piece. Well, it's not because you can see the sunlight in between this. So there's some kind of weird arch thing right here. And it goes down and there's some pots, something sticking out of this thing. Um, and then this is over here. See how it's like just nice and it's got this nice smooth edge to it. And it comes down almost like a faucet kind of thing. But um, And then you've got this piece of metal under here. And you can see it comes right to here. And it's got like another line sticking right there, like another drawing or some kind of lettering. There's like one here, kind of buried, another, another, and then something, some kind of little line right there. So I don't know what this stuff is, but and you can see it right there. And then one, two, three letterings, and whatever this is up here. Okay. And like I said, you, you know, uh, you know, I'll just get your thoughts on this thing. But like I said, I mean, this is a very simple uh, anomaly, but this it has it implies a whole lot. It's got a lot of implications to it because, like I said, if there's if this is actual, because how many pitches even have I seen, I mean, I've had a couple, looks like vehicles that are smooth metal, you know, halfway buried in the dirt, uh, what look like vehicles and everything else, but when you get something as clear as this, as far as it looks like a metal piece, I mean, what else could it be? It can't be a piece of paper shining like that, um, but, <laughs> then again, who knows, right? Uh, but to me, that's steel, and like I said, here's this weird pot coming out right here, and there's something inside it, see like this? It's something right here is just kind of stuck inside this thing. So I don't know what this is, to be honest with you. I just I just don't know. Um, and this block right here and this piece right here, it kind of does this and there's something inside it. So I don't know if this is part of this coming up. I, I don't know. And then I threw a little color in it there for you. And you can just see that a little bit better. See how it kind of enhances some of the areas right in here, like all these little details? What? just seems like you can see a little bit better. And you can see where they're really manipulated. You can see these little lines and... Stuff like that. But there's that piece right there. Okay. And it looks like there's like little pieces in here. So this is some kind of... See right here? This rounded piece. And right here. And I'm going to back this out. I'll do 50. And you guys can check it out if you want. But I think that's too small. So I'll go to the 100. And like I said, if you guys want to check this out with a magnifier or what have you. Um, whatever it is, it makes it easy for you guys to really check this thing. I don't want you guys to miss a thing. This is the reason why I do these things. Some people probably say, why is he wasting his time doing this? Well, because it's some people really are into this and they really want to scrutinize these pictures. And this is why I do it. So there's another thing over here too. I don't know if you guys have seen this, but I'll, let me just jump into this one real quick. I looked at this and it kind of looked like a goofy glove right here. Now, it's been manipulated, so you know how that goes. But it looks like this like a, would be a thumb right here. One, two, three, four. So you get the four fingers in your thumb. But I was thinking, well, but the, if that was your pinky finger on the end here, it actually has a long, uh, funkier-looking uh, glove pod, if that's a glove. Um, so, yeah. Um, but I actually enhanced that just for the heck of it, just so you guys can check that out as well. Um let me just jump right in. And here it is right here. Okay. Okay, this is what I, like I said, and that looks really pixelated, and of course that's going to happen, especially when you just kind of equalize it out. But let's see it right there. Okay, let's blur it up a little bit. And like I said, I'm doing this for the people too, as far as uh, wanting to check it out, as far as the magnifiers. See how like it's just got this one piece here, and then one, two, Three, and then this is kind of longer, so I don't know. Unless these humanoids have funky-looking fingers, I don't know what that is. I mean, that, I mean to be honest with you guys, it just looks like a glove. I'm not saying that's what it is. Um, you know, I, I don't know. Um, it could be anything. And like I said, I did it, actually flip it around, and it actually still has this weird kind of hook to this <laughs> last finger, so to speak. And one, two, three, and then the small piece here. But then it's all blurred out right there, so it's, it's kind of hard to tell. I just... I just happened to see that and just figured I'd have a little fun with that one there. Um, but it kind of looked like one just laying there. Um, but anyway, guys, you know, just like I said, this is just a short video. Um, this is just before, uh, this is probably five minutes to midnight here. So, um, uh, I'm sorry, five minutes to 11. 
Um, but I'll be kicking back there just like most of you guys, just chilling out. Um, just, you know, uh, just relax for the New Year's. You know, just chill out with the family and relax. And uh, that's it, you know. Just taking some relaxation, no work and no nothing. I'm good with that. Um, but anyway, guys, uh, let me know what you guys think. I mean, like I said, I flipped this over. Um, and I did happen to see it looked like this weird, I wouldn't say an A, because there's no way of knowing what it is over here. I don't know if it's some kind of other funky leg to it or over it underneath this crusted area. Now, it looks like parts of it's crusted, and parts of it is definitely, you know, has been uh, manipulated. So, um, But like I said, this you don't see this right here that much. You just kind of see this right here, and there's something sticking out. I don't know if that's been modified. It's definitely been manipulated, because you can see it's, uh, it's, it's, it's blurry. I mean, you know, no other way to show that. But you can see here this perfectly half round piece here, and there's something in it. So I don't know if these are just pots, and it's hard to tell, I mean, at this point. But you can see this clearly nice and clean, nice round, half half round circle. So, um, and this cube thing or whatever this is, part of this or whatever, I don't know. Um, but this one here, this, like I said, this just kind of caught me. Um, I just thought that was pretty neat. And I figured I'd share that with you, you know, being... Um, and like I said, this is the latest picture, guys. This is 494. Uh, this is the latest one they have up anyway. And like I said, it was on the 26th. Um, and like I said, uh, I can back out here. And you can see it right here. This image was taken by Mascam, left Mascam, on board NASA's Mars rover Curiosity on Sol 494. And it says the 26th to the 12th, 2013. And, and if, like I said, I'm still waiting for them to put up the newest one. So, you know, like I said, guys, I'm all over this stuff. Um, you know, the latest stuff, believe me, I'm all over it. This is where to find it, um, you know, and you guys can check it out. Because, like I said, I mean, it's it's anybody's guess what half these things are. Um, I just tell you what I think it looks like, and then you guys tell me what you think. I mean, you, it could be something total different to you guys, but you know the drill as far as my um, my regular subscribers. You know, you guys are good like that, and um, I don't have to explain that to you. But all these new guys that come on, you know, some of them don't even look at one of my uh, videos, and they're like, oh, this guy's on drugs. It's like, no, it's you'd be surprised. I'm not on drugs. Uh, but if that looks like a rock right here in the center of this, then I think we know who's on drugs, um, because that's no rock. I can promise you that. Um, but anyway, <laughs> um, like I said, you guys tell me what you think it is. I mean, I just, just saw that, and I was just, wow, that's kind of funky. Did they overlook that? Apparently not. If they modified this and this stuff over here, and certainly this, whatever this is, I didn't even bother to try to check that out. Um, let me see. Let me go down here. Eh, who knows? Maybe we'll just take a look at that real quick. What do you think? All right. Let's do that. You don't want to worry about that little glove thing. And this is... Well, let's do, let's do a little... Okay. Um, yeah, let's go. Blur it up a little bit. Okay. Um, boo, 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 boo. Uh, I may not be able to get too much out of it, but let's just see what happens. Well, let's do an invert. See what happens. You can't see much of anything in there, eh? Okay, let's do this. All right. See, it's hard to tell what that is, but it looks like there's like two little lines sticking out right here. One, and there's one behind it right there. One, two, and it has this weird thing coming down. See it right there? Coming out of the ground, it has this little kind of like curve to it right here, and then goes up. I don't know if you guys can see that. It comes down, it has this little step down. See it? I just noticed that. Okay, let's just hit that one here. Let me just zoom into here a little bit more. But see how it's got like this weird one? And there's something right here, back here. And then look at the way this comes down. One comes down here. Huh. Has this little step. And of course, they blurred this out so you can't see what this actually is. But you can see that. I mean, it's pretty plain. See that right there? There's one, and there's one behind it. And like I said, it's coming down like that there. Huh. And I didn't even look at this earlier. I just happen to want to look at it now. Uh, let's throw a little color in there and see what that does. Yeah. Let me just do this. Zoom in again. Okay. Yeah, that's pretty good right there, guys. I mean... It's like, like I said, there's something that's pretty wide right here, but it comes down, goes down like this, got this little curvature right here, and then it comes down, and now this is all pixelated out, so I don't know what that is, but you see it comes down, has this little corner, and it comes down, and then 
something here, one, and then two, it looks like there's something here, like a matching whatever this is, so that's uh, kind of goofy, man. I didn't even see that and just decided to look at it now. Um, you know, you never can tell, and I just did a couple of the things in the pictures, guys. I mean, there's a bunch of it here. Look at it. This rock has got something on it. I mean, heck, I can tell that just by looking at the thing. I can see this right here. It's like all been manipulated out. You can just see it's super grainy there, but this whole picture's been like this. I mean, it's it's just nuts, but um, who knows? Maybe we'll do something else with this uh, um, this picture further in the, in the future here. Well, uh, pretty, pretty close. But see how, like, this, you really can't see much of anything right there. It just looks like nothing. I mean, it just, it's a blurred out piece of garbage. I mean, and then just by, right off the bat, you can see there's some kind of form to it. It's taking some kind of form. But like I said, they just put some crap over this just to, all right, get rid of that. And you can see that pretty darn good, guys. I mean, like I said, you can't see what's up here. Because you can see where they kind of cut it off. But right here, you can see it's got some form to it. Some kind of uh, piece. It's some kind of mechanical piece, that's for sure. It doesn't look like a typical rock. So, anyway, guys, I just figured I'd shoot that to you to see what you guys thought, especially with this uh, other piece here at the top, uh, this piece of steel. To me, it's a piece of steel. Um, you guys can tell me, as always, what you guys think it is. But, like I said, there's a ridge right there and right there. So, you can see it's pretty, it's from here, it's this thickness right here. And then whatever it does over here, I don't know. But, um, like I said, it's, eh, it's definitely not a rock. So, and then you get, the, like I said, this half round piece over here sticking out I mean you can just see it's got some kind of flat piece it's got an edge right here like rectangular see it comes down and goes like this here see it whatever that is got this here I don't know like I said you guys can tell me what you think that is and you know but hey that's what it's all about man find these little details find this stuff bring it to you guys you guys tell me what you think it is you know what I mean that's what this channel is all about let's find what this stuff is let's find the truth and it just gives you something to do I mean it's it's just me it's I love doing this stuff I love finding this stuff um, like I said I may not always be correct on what this stuff is but to me um, you can I, I think you guys can all agree that 99% of the stuff I have have on here is not they're not rocks uh, you know whether you agree or disagree what they are what I say it is or what I think it is you know um, it really doesn't matter because you can guarantee that's not a rock in there uh, so um, but anyway hey guys like I said uh, uh, as usual you know like I said this is, this is gonna be the uh, the last picture of the uh, of the year of 2013 but uh, as always like I said we're gonna turn it up a notch come 2014 we're gonna rock this thing and uh, see if we can really stop pulling out of these and uh, hopefully they'll stop putting up pitches and uh, China's putting up the Chengi uh, more Chengi 3 uh, pitches and stuff like that and um, you know, that's what it's all about, man. Just stay on top of the stuff and see what they're hiding and see what they're not doing. I mean, I just did a video on how much they really messed that, that one up. They just did the, uh, it shows the uh, Jade Rabbit driving away from the land, uh, for the uh, the lander itself. I mean, it's a mess. I mean, they totally, oh my God, mutilated the picture is just, you know, I guess it's a word we can use for it because they just, I mean, blatantly lied to the people. I mean, it's, you can see how they doctored this thing up around the little rover and around this mass cam and his little uh, satellite dish there. So you could, guys could check that out and see what I'm talking about. But hey, guys, um, I hope everybody has a good uh, New Year's. Uh, I hope you guys don't party it up too much tonight. Um, and just uh, if you do, well, at least you got tomorrow to just sleep it off. But um, for anybody who's going to be just like, you know, rocking in the new year and uh, I'm going to be taking it easy tomorrow, relax with the family, and I hope you guys do the same. Have a safe one, you know what I mean? But anyway, guys, have a good one. Thanks for watching as always, and I will see you next year and next pick.